What's this area of the ship? This is the combat information center. Here, the crew receives sensor data. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. I'm Yeoman Kelly Chambers. I've been assigned as your administrative assistant. I'll manage your messages and help you monitor the crew. And I must say, it's such an honor to work under you, Commander Shepard. I'm glad to have you on the team, Miss Chambers. Please, call me Kelly. Okay, Kelly. Anything else? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Joker would like to speak to you on the bridge. Anything else, Commander? Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. This organization has a dark reputation. Do you have any concerns working for them? Not at all. Our methods can be harsh, but Cerberus has noble objectives. We look out for human interests. Advance human technology, save human lives. They're good goals. It sounds like Cerberus wants to dominate all aliens and put humankind on top. Cerberus looks out for humanity, but that doesn't mean we hate aliens. My sister started a dog shelter, but she loved cats too. I love humanity. I also love Asari, Quarian, Turian, Salarian, Hanar. That isn't in conflict with Cerberus ideals. That's a very positive attitude. What can I say? I'm a people person. Anything else you'd like to talk about? How do you feel about being assigned to the Normandy? I was handpicked by the Elusive Man to help fight the greatest threat known to humanity. How do I feel? Honored, exhilarated, terrified. But mostly I feel encouraged. Under your leadership, we can't fail. Don't worry. We'll defeat the Collectors. I trust you implicitly. The moment I met you, I knew I could close my eyes, fall back, and you'd be there. I might do more than catch you, Kelly. Now that's an enticing thought. Anything else you'd like to talk about? I'd better go. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. Can you believe this, Commander? It's my baby! Better than new! It fits me like a glove! And leather seats! Military may set the hardware standard, but on a first-gen frigate, they could care less if the seats breathe. Civilian sector comfort by design. The reproduction is not intended to be perfect, Mr. Moreau. Seamless improvements were made. And there's the downside. I liked the Normandy when she was beautiful and quiet. Now she's got this thing I don't want to talk about. It's like ship cancer. Enjoy it, Joker. If we're stuck here, we might as well let them pamper us. Uh, does it breach uniform regs if I get that on a cruise shirt? Because this is my favorite, you have no choice, choice ever. Technically, this is a civilian ship. I'm probably lucky you're still wearing pants. Yeah, I'll save that for the off-hour cameras. Have an AI watch me 24-7. Shirts.
Welcome aboard, Commander. Commander, there hasn't been time to really settle in and take stock. I want to say that working with you is a great opportunity to do something that matters. It's a privilege to serve on the Normandy, Commander. You may change your tune if we end up like the original Normandy. Maybe. As long as the elusive man walks his talk, and you do the same, I'll do my best to make sure we succeed. That's been the condition for my service so far. I have issues with certain actions Cerberus has taken in the past. What has Cerberus done to make you nervous? A lot. They've been called terrorists, and with good reason. Doubt you can find a more checkered past. But if the Collector threat is real, and we do something about it, Cerberus will be remembered differently. Or we'll all be tried and executed. Can't count on people thinking about it as hard as I have. It's good to hear a clear opinion. Sounds like we're two of a kind. That honors me more than you, Commander. Let me know if you need anything.